<coughs> hello guys uh, you have welcome back to my python youtube channel and in this python tutorial we will be learning about how to do a 2d plot of a mofat function so basically mofat function is equation this equation i equal to i naught 1 plus r by alpha square and whole raised to power minus beta so basically this uh, equation is used to describe the star light profile and sometimes it is only used to describe the core of a star that how a star uh, i mean how the flux varies uh, with the radius uh, of a star so here we have radius r and x0 y0 are the center uh, of the uh, star so this is like our mofat uh, 2d plot so in this video we will be, we will be constructing similar plot uh, using python code so let's try to do this uh, 2d plot of mofat function using the above equation so let's do it so for that we will import some libraries import library so import numpy for array and matplotlib for plotting now what to do now we will define that our mofat function so comment here define mofat function so for that define mofat and then you give uh, its parameter so we should have x we should have y and then we have uh, alpha and beta parameters and i naught so you can say we need amplitude and then you need say you need alpha then you need beta so these are the parameters it will take and now we also need to define here r so let's define r equal to so r equal to np dot it's a square root of x minus say x is center and then a square of this and plus y minus yc square and you need to close the hole yeah now it's fine so we also got and now you need to define your returning uh, function so for that type return and what you want just type this uh, whole function so we have amplitude we have amplitude into 1 plus 
and then we have say r square by alpha square so basically your um, alpha and beta like parameters and then you want always to power minus beta always to power minus beta so power minus beta sorry so this is like we have defined our function and we have done it now we need to plot it so we need to give our x and y so for that we can give x equal to linear space and you want you can give from minus 20 to 20 or you want to give it to say 100 points similarly you can also define y and also in the same manner so just copy it you have got y now we need to create a mesh grid so for that we define in that way capital X capital capital Y equal to np dot mesh grid and then xy array so this way you can get your mesh grid uh, so and like for every uh, grid will give uh, your your uh, that intensity value uh, in that grid and it will plot so now how to give, give that intensity value to, to any grid so for that type z so z equal to call it mofat recall it mofat and then give you need capital x capital y and then give your uh, say amplitude so suppose i want to give amplitude equal to 100 100 and then you need to give your alpha beta so alpha i can give uh, say 6 and beta i can give beta i can give 4.5 And also you need to give your center so center you can give like uh, we have yeah so you can give you can give it zero 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 the center now I need to plot it so for that image so we'll do pld dot im so and then z and then we need to do a color bar plt dot color bar and then so it plt Purity dot so now run it. Seven elements were given. in the punch
Okay, so we also need to give here XC and YC. Okay, so I now run it. See, this is the plot of our Moffat uh, distribution of the our star. Now we can make it more bigger. So add interactive control. So percentage mat plot leave. Now run it. So you got your keys. Now you can zoom it. So this is like your Mofia distribution of your light profile of a star. So mainly Mofia is used to like construct a little profile of a star uh, in the core. So it has a wide application in astronomy and astrophysics. So this way. And here is your color bar. You can see. The color device bar is going from 0 to 100 and this yellow is like maximum. You can also change the, you can also change its color bar, say you can call it C map equal to jet. See the color bar has changed right now. It is looking this way. So this is our like our Moffat 2D plot of a star a radial profile. So this way you can plot. So let's check it what we have done. We have like inputted numpy and matplotlib. We have defined Moffat function and we have defined around uh, center x c and y c and we have r equal to square root of x square plus y square around the center and then we defined x y data and then we have recalled our Moffat function with uh, some initial values and then we have simply plotted it so this is our plot and this is how it's uh, look like and we can change like different you can choose different uh, type of color plots color bar so you can see that center has like maximum value let's zoom it so this is how a star looks like it's like something like it's a box size so see the star value the center of the star is like highly uh, it has like high intensity and it is around like 99 okay so this way you can create a 2d Moffat radial profile of a star by using python so it is very helpful in the astronomy and astrophysics so basically when you are doing of the personal astrophysics on the feeds file it is quite helpful so i hope uh, uh, this uh, video tutorial has helped you to get some insight about how to plot a mofat 2d function uh, for a radial profile of your star using python and if you think uh, you get some and knowledge from this uh, watching this video tutorial on python then please uh, subscribe my channel and share it with others those who need it so thank you again